Aloha folks, I'm Kira Balul with your Maui Now headlines. The family of Eduardo Alejandro Alex Cerizo, who was killed in a bathroom at Queen Kaahumanu Center in March, spoke out this week with hopes to bring awareness to the issue of public safety. Family members say they are also requesting an independent investigation be conducted into security measures employed by the mall and the Maui bus saying, quote, if our son's death could have been prevented, we want to make sure the same mistakes are not repeated and no other families have to suffer as we are suffering, end quote. Maui Tacos is expanding nationwide with six new store openings scheduled for 2018 and 12 new stores slated for 2019. The six new stores this year will open in Kahului, Monroe, Louisiana, Pearl City, Oahu, Charleston, South Carolina, Reno, Nevada, and Las Vegas, Nevada. The 10 new stores in 2019 will include a Hilo location as well, and franchise opportunities remain available. A 70-year-old Australian woman was medically evacuated from a cruise ship off Maui en route to San Diego this week after she was experiencing severe abdominal pains. Around 3 a.m. on Tuesday, a rescue team hoisted the woman from the regatta, who was safely transported to Kahului Airport, where emergency medical crews were waiting. She then went to the hospital in stable condition. The Hawaii state bird, the Nene, could be downlisted from endangered to threatened after numbers have climbed from only 30 in 1960 to more than 2,800 today. There are currently 616 living on Maui and 35 on Molokai. The Nene retains protection as a threatened species based on ongoing threats from non-native predators such as mongoose and cats, habitat destruction, and vehicle collisions. Thanks so much for watching Maui Now. Everything Maui, always now.